the biggest project in the world of IT right now, information technology, is to connect everything that can be connected. It's an audacious undertaking. Consider it like this. Uh, for the last 40 years, we've been starting to connect computers in various ways. And in the last 25 years, we've been connecting computers to the World Wide Web. In the last 20 years, we've started to connect mobile phones. So today, you've got hundreds of millions of computers and billions of smartphones connected to the internet. But that's just the beginning. Now, each year, the number of devices that are not smartphones or computers, smart devices, if you will, uh, IoT devices, Internet of Things devices, this number is growing really quickly. There are now already tens of billions of devices, by some estimates, more than 20 billion devices that are not phones or computers connected to the internet. And that number is only going to increase. But beyond that, we're also starting to see the deployment of huge numbers of sensors little tiny chips that can detect something. They can detect uh, heat, temperature, light, and so forth. Um, these sensors are going to be embedded in the environment around us, in the roads, in the cities, uh, in the buildings, in the hospitals, in the schools. Uh, also, sometimes they'll be embedded in our bodies. And so you can start to think of these concentric circles. In the beginning, in the middle, hundreds of millions of computers connected to billions of smartphones, connected to tens of billions of smart devices, and then on the outskirts, trillions of sensors. And these sensors are able to detect all the objects around them. And that's how we're going to start to connect and detect every item in the world. What unifies all these things? What's going to connect all these things together? Some sort of standardized identity, some kind of identity that spans the digital world and the physical world, something that can be read by humans or scanned and interpreted by a machine. That's where the need for an interoperable, persistent identity standard comes from.